Hello friends, so today we are going to discuss this problem from code forces round 651, problem C, number 8. So Ashish Gupta and Fastest Stringer playing a game and they start a game with a number N and they play in turn. In each turn, a player can make only one of the following moves. Divide N with any of its odd devices. So you are given an N and you can divide it with any of its odd devices or you can subtract one from it n is greater than equal greater than 1 and you have to come down to 1 because you cannot move uh, like any chance if you are at 1 okay now divisor of a number includes the number itself this is an important point because the number itself it's a divisor of it the player who is unable to make a move loses the game so you have to find out ashish gupta moves first okay so this is the thing ashish gupta always move first and then you have to determine the answer in such a the, in such type of questions in number theory, the there is always an optimal way to, to find out a solution. It is not random. You always have to write down some cases and see that for all the cases how you can come down to certain solutions always. Okay, so I written down the cases and let's start with this. So this is Ashkupta and Pasis. So now if n is equal to one, now because the first turn is of Ashish Gupta and n is equal to 1, he cannot do anything. Okay, so Ashish Gupta cannot take any turn because it's equal to 1. And thus Ashish Gupta loses. If n is equal to 2, then Ashish Gupta can subtract 1 from it and then it will become equal to 1. And after that, because Ashish Gupta had taken his turn, Pasha's finger will take its turn and Pasha's finger cannot do anything because it is equal to 1 and thus he loses and Ashish Gupta will win. Okay. So now these are the first two cases I have taken down because it is easy. Now generalize it for odd number because as you can see for every odd number, the odd number is a divisor of itself. So let us assume we are talking about 3 or 5 or 101. If 101 is a divisor of itself and n is equal to this, then Ashish Gupta in its turn well, because it's first Ashish Gupta turn, he wants to play such that he will win. So what he'll do here is he will divide this with the odd divisor, and then it will turn out to be one. And Pasha's finger cannot do anything because like it's one, he cannot do anything, and thus Ashish Gupta will win. So that's why every person will move according to its optimality, and thus in this case, if it's odd number, uh, like if the n, the starting n is odd number. So now we have talked about odd numbers. Now, if it is not odd number, it can be an even number. So the cases for even number is it's only made up of even number. There are no odd numbers in which it can be 16, 8, 32. It's a power of even number. If, a, if it is a power of even number, then Ashish Gupta is the first. Two. Okay. Now Ashish Gupta cannot divide it with an odd divisor because it doesn't have any odd divisor. It's just even number. Thus, Ashish Gupta has only one move he can subtract minus one from. So, if it's like 16 or 8, if you subtract one from it, it will turn out to be an odd number. And you have known that for odd number, the person will divide it with the odd number and will win. So, if Ashish Gupta gets an even number, whose power, like, who, even number which is just a power of 2, he will subtract one from it. Now, Ashish finger will divide the whole odd number with an odd number and Ashish Gupta cannot move and thus Ashish Gupta will lose. And thus, for this case, in which Ashish Gupta get a number which is just 2 to the power x, he will always lose. Now, such that Ashish Gupta num get a number in which it is a 2 to the power x, but it also gets some odd number, in which like it's 30, in which it's 2 to the power 2 into 15. Okay, now if it's this number, or let's assume it's 4, so it's like 60. 4 to, the power 50, 4 to the power 50. Now, in this case, what Ashish Gupta can easily do here is Ashish Gupta can take out because it's Ashish Gupta turn first. He will have to win. So, what he can do here is he will take out the whole odd part because he can divide it with the odd divisor and he will take out this odd part. Now, as you can see, the Ashish finger will turn out with a number which is just a power of 2. If it's just a power of 2, and this number should be greater than or equal to 2 because if it's equal to 2 then Pasha's finger can subtract 1 and Ashish Gupta cannot move but if it, it's 
just a power of 2 greater than or equal to 2 then if first finger subtract one from it it turns to be odd now ashikupta can divide it with an odd number and first finger will fall uh, like not there. but if it turns out to be so as you can see if it's 2 to the power x x is greater than or equal to 2 and it's an odd number also then ashikupta will win in this case but as you can see if it's just an 2 then odd number now there are two cases if the odd number is prime or the odd number is not prime because why we have taken down this case so let's assume it's 2 and it's 3 okay now and it's 2 and 5 or 15 which is through 3 into 5 if this is ashikupta turn ashikupta wants to win we want to set his conditions so that he will win eventually now if ashikupta has this odd number if you take out this odd number what he, what faster finger can do he can subtract minus from front one from it and thus ashikupta cannot do anything and ashikupta will lose but in this case same if ashikupta take out the whole prime like whole part of this odd number he will turn out to be two and faster finger will subtract one from it and faster finger will win but ashikupta can do a trick here Ashikupta, instead of taking out this whole number, he will take out just a part of this odd number. And if we just take out this part of an odd number, fastest finger gets this number. Now, fastest finger will also try to take out, take out this odd number. If fastest finger take out this odd number, then what will happen? Because now Ashikupta get with 2. And if you subtract minus 1 from it, uh, like fastest finger cannot move and Ashikupta will win. So as you can see why in this case Ashikupta win because he will take out any number because it is not a prime number Ashikupta can take out a, some part of it such that it will become a prime number and if it become a prime number fastest finger cannot take out any like if you take out this odd divisor he had to take out it as a whole if you take out as a whole then Ashikupta will get a, a number which is 2 to the power of something and thus it will turn out to be eventually we have talked about all the cases so this is all the cases you have to talk or you have to look into so i will take on to the code now to make it more understandable so what i have done here is i have taken down the input of n s1 is ashikupta and s2 is fast finger if n is equal to equal to 1 then fast finger will win because ashikupta cannot move if n equal to 2 then ashikupta will subtract 1 from it and fast finger cannot move and thus ashikupta will win if n is greater than or equal to 2 and it's odd, then Ashikupta will win. Now, if n is greater than or equal to 2 and it's an even number, then in this case, because it's even, then it can be a whole of power of 2. Then to check if this number is just a power of 2, we can use bit manipulation, which is an easy technique. So let's assume it's 16, which is 1, 0, 0, 0. Okay, so if it's 16, now if it's equal to n, and you do take n minus 1, which is 15, which is equal to 0, 1, 1, 1, and 1. If you don't add of these two numbers, it turns out to be 0. Every bit just flipped out, and it turns out to be 0 if you do an add number. And so, what you can observe here is if this number is just a power of 2. There is always be one bit here and all the rest of them are 0. And if you do an n minus 1, all the rest of these bits will become set and this will bit will become non-set. And thus if you do an and operation of this, it will turn out to be 0. And so this is a clear check technique to te tell if this number is made up of only to the power of n or something like that. So what I have done here is if this condition holds true, then Ashikupta has no other chance but to subtract 1 from it. If you subtract 1 from it, then fast finger will divide the whole number with an odd number and Ashikupta cannot move further and thus fast finger will win and the answer is S2. Now, the other case can be, if it doesn't made up of all the even number, it must be consisting of some odd number. So, the case can be, if it consists of some odd numbers but it has a power which is greater than or equal to 2 to power 2, which is equal to 4. So, if it has some divisor equal to 4 then this case will hold and Ashikupta will win and thus if n is mod 4 equal to 0 it has some divisor equal to 4 then Ashikupta will win other than this if 
this condition is not holding true, it doesn't have a divisor 4, it means that the number is having only a multiple of 2 because we are only talking about even number here in this else. So it means that it is an even number and it's not divisor of 4, then it will only be having only 2 because it's even. And if it's even, then we only have to check whether this number is prime or not. So how we can check this? Because this whole number is equal to n, if we divide n by 2, if we take this out here, we are just talking about this odd number. And we just have to talk about this odd number is prime or not. So what we'll do? We will do n divided by 2 and we check it is a prime number or not. And prime number will just do this function, you'll know how to check a prime number or not. If it's a prime number, then uh, like fast finger will win. If it's not a prime number, Ashish can take out some parts such that fast finger will will have the odd part which is the prime number and Ashish will win eventually. So this is the whole code and the whole techniques. If you still have any doubt, please mention now. Thank you for watching this video. I'll see you in the next one. Keep coding. Bye.